Hello everyone and welcome, this is Al Nichols. Thanks for tuning in. I'm going to be doing something a little bit different with this video. Actually, strike that. I'm going to be doing something a lot different with this video because this marks the first time that I'm ever going to do a live action video for my channel. And not only that, but it's also the first time I'm ever going to do an unboxing type video. Although, to be technically correct, it's not as much an unboxing video as it will be an unbagging video because as you can see, I have a couple of handfuls of the Series 17 collectible minifigure series before me, and, um, you know, I've always been a fan of the collectible minifigures uh, ever since Series 1. The minifigures themselves and the accessories have come in handy over the years as I've made my uh, stop-motion videos, and they've certainly helped to get the creative juices flowing. And I've always wanted to do a video unique to a new series, but stop-motion animation being what it is and being as time-consuming as it is, I've never felt that I was able to produce something timely enough with the release, and so I've never done it. Uh, until just now, I had the idea, you know what, why don't I go to my local Lego store, grab a couple of handfuls of bags, and just open them, open them up, and see what we get. I think that'll be uh, fun and interesting, and so that's where we are, and that's what we're going to do. So uh, so let's just get right into it. So to start it off, you know, the wrinkle this year with this series is the mystery minifigure. Although in today's internet age, it's uh, nearly impossible to keep a secret. And by now we all know that the um, mystery minifigure is a highwayman, uh, which actually looks like a pretty cool figure. Uh, but, you know, I'm hoping to get one of those. Uh, I do like that figure. There's a couple that I do like. I like the connoisseur. I like the rocket boy. I like the, the corn man's interesting. And uh, I like the phone that the yuppie has, that old style phone. It's pretty cool. So a lot of minifigures that I'm hoping to get. Um... Let's just get right to it. So, um, let's start. And, oh, look at that. Right off the bat, we got a highway man. Uh, that is pretty cool. This is a, this is actually a pretty cool looking figure. Um, the printing on it is pretty good. I like the mask here. I like the face. That's a great hat. One of those hats and the two guns. I like this figure a lot. Actually, I'm hoping to get a couple of these. I, you know, I, I like the idea of doing a period piece with these uniforms and with these hats. And so if I get more than one, I like the, it's a unique cape. I like the, I don't normally put capes on, but, um, I do like that figure. That is, we're off to a good start. Uh, let's just, mark that off as complete. We got that guy. So here we go. What's up? What's next? Hopefully I cut a cape as I use the scissors. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Interesting. Two in a row. What are the odds? Um, you know what? But like I said, I was hoping to get a couple and mission accomplished. Uh, I do like this figure, like I said, so I don't mind that at all. You know, that's the that's the risk you take when you grab bags at random, um, but I'm cool with that. Actually, the hat has a little uh, place for it that if you wanted to wear a feather or some sort of other accoutrement, you could put it up there. Uh, nice. I like it. Like I said, the printing. I like the the ruffle shirt. Well done. Two, two for two. Pretty interesting. Nothing new to check off on my list. Let's keep going. Bag number three. What do we got? What's in store? <laughs> Look at that. Another one. Three in a row. Hooray for me. I dropped the head. Interesting. All right. <laughs> I do like the figure though, so that's good. Um, I like that connoisseur too. I'd like to get one of those, but we got a lot more to go. I think I put that on upside down. Hat on. Guns ablazing. Nice. All right. Uh, 
Very good. And a third cape. Let's keep going. What do we have here? <laughs> all right. Yes, it is a, all right. What? All right. So I'm four in a row. I think I should probably play the lottery because I'm thinking that is probably pretty unprecedented. Four in a row. Although, I guess not entirely unexpected because I was looking at the box distribution, the minifigure distribution per box, and the most of any individual minifigure in a single box is five, and so, and the, the Highwayman was one of those where there were five in a box, so that's cool. I'm beating the odds, but still nonetheless, um, pretty interesting. Okay. All right. Very good. Here's another one. Um, <laughs> five highwaymen. It's going to be a band of highwaymen. I don't know. Did they work? I thought, I seem to, th I don't know. Maybe Did they work together in pairs or were they kind of lone wolves? They worked alone. I don't know. But um, I got a lot of those, you know, tri-point hats there, which is good, I guess. Um, Okay, let's mix it up. Let's go from that end. Not that it matters because the bags are the bags, but um, let's see. All right, that's five, so this should be something different here. What do we got? Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. Another one. Wonderful. Great. Um. <laughs> Guns, gun, stand, cape. I do like that. I do like that cape, though. Let's see. What do we got? Something different. I can feel it feels a little different. Let's see. Maybe this is the muscle man. What's this one? No, it's a highway man. Another, another highway man. Um, so this is very exciting, isn't it? Just like I had planned. This is amazing. Um, <laughs> maybe, maybe someone would like to trade. Um, I don't know. Well, I, you know, <laughs> like I said, maybe I should pay the, play the lottery because seven. Um, seven. Luck's going to change. It's going to be, what's it going to be this time? Something different. I can feel, feel it. All right. <laughs> Woo. All right. Look at this. Look at this. It's a highway man. Highway man. Another one. Oh, uh, yeah. This. Yep. Maybe, uh, I put the thing on upside down. It doesn't matter at this point. We know what it looks like. I think we know what it looks like at this point. Um, yay. It's different. It's, oh, who cares? Let's see. Yeah. All right. Oh, of course, of course, of course. Another highway man. One. You know this. Oh, jeez. You know this reminds me of. I can't remember. It was early on, like series four or five, maybe. I don't remember. But there was a. Um, uh, one of the figures was a cave woman. And, you know, I, I, I like that figure, the cave woman, but I got four of them one time. And, um, you know, I, I don't, I didn't really need four. So this is kind of bringing back flashbacks of the cave woman from series four or five. Um, um, 
right, let's see. Oh man. Okay. Let's see. Cut that open. What do we got? Oh, something different. What? Wait a minute. The, this series. This is series five. This is this is the cave woman. Wonderful. Look. The, all right. That that's what was this lot number? Something's up. <laughs> um, that doesn't make any sense. Why would a Series 5 cave woman be in a Series 17 bag? Something is up. I don't get it. Eh, I still don't like this figure. Um, I don't... Uh, what's, all right, well, this one feels different. So, all right, we know this is different. All right, what the hell is this? Golden Ticket. Greetings to you, the lucky finder of this golden ticket from the manufacturer. Present this ticket at the factory gates at 10 o'clock in the morning of the first day of October and do not be late. You may bring with you one member of your own family, and only one, but no one else. In your wildest dreams, you cannot imagine the marvelous surprises that await you. Uh, Alright, so obviously something is going on. Um, uh, I don't... I don't know what to... I don't know what to say here. Uh, I gotta, I gotta figure this out. But, uh, hello everyone. This is Al Nichols. I hope you enjoyed that last video. It certainly was, um, interesting, I think is the proper word. I just wanted to give you a quick heads up that I'm going to have a new video coming out in the next, oh, seven to 10 days, hopefully sooner, but it'll probably be about seven to 10 days. And actually, you're not going to want to miss this one. It's actually very interesting. Believe it or not, I actually have some inside information on the next Star Wars movie, The Last Jedi, and so I made a stop motion video about it. It's gonna, you know, it's gonna have spoilers in it, but um, I think, I think you're gonna want to watch it. So be on the lookout for that. Uh, take care.